Okay, so we're checking out the only game where you can take a forklift and shove the forks up the rectum of your boss. It's Truck and Logistic Simulator. You wouldn't know that though because there's no freaking splash screen! So the point of this game is to drive large pieces of machinery very professionally and complete missions and get money. That's not going to happen. I know exactly what games like this are made with. If there's not a way for me to get a freaking forklift to leave the atmosphere of the earth, I'm not gonna be happy enough. I like that over in the options menu, there's a place for you to select your driver. Your options are Kyle, a dude from Canada, or Karen. Oh, this is one of these types of games, huh? You know while I'm rolling through a school zone at like 110 miles an hour in a dump truck, we're gonna be doing it as Karen. I find it interesting that there's all these different vehicles when this isn't even what the game is centered around. This is a rigid truck, a regular truck. What the hell's other vi- Is that a goddamn monster truck? Okay, I think we've gone to a place in this game that probably shouldn't exist. I don't know how the hell you're supposed to get this, but we're not stopping until we have it. I love how everything is like ripped from Google Images. It's so highly rendered, except for the trailer hitch. The trailer hitch looks like a Reese's peanut butter cup getting stabbed by a double A battery. Also, how come it's already rusted? I'm not buying this bit used. What is this? What is this? Oh, you get to be inside of it. Mud Ratto. Not gonna lie, I'm kind of surprised when I got in here there wasn't a bunch of beer cans just sitting on the floorboard already. God, I don't want to touch the steering wheel. I feel like I'm gonna get tetanus. Like a proper Karen, the only thing I could afford was this minivan. Please tell me I can change the color. What the hell is this? Oh, it's the tent. See, this is when you live in Washington state. This is when you live in Florida. Everyone down here in Florida has a legal tent because if you don't, you get cancer immediately. I like how I paid 120th what the monster truck is worth and it's a hundred times cleaner. You guys couldn't even fill up the gas tank? Check engine lights already on, makes sense. Oh, I can change the dashboard lighting. Does it come in hot pink? It absolutely does. Yeah, let's go ahead and just real quick, I just wanna Barbie everything. Nice. If there's one thing I love doing, it's oversaturating everything until it gives me cataracts. Now that's hot. All right, let's go do dumb sh** and buy a monster truck. So, um, what, um, what is this game? Is this, is this your loading screen? Am I, am I supposed to do something? We're playing no tutorial rules, huh? Okay, that's fine. I didn't want to read your tutorial anyway. What the hell was that? I clicked on the sun. God, it is just like Florida. Say hello to Karen. She pilots her vehicle diligently with hands on 12 and two, elbows flared out, prepared to ask for somebody's manager. Oh, I have the ability to manipulate time and space. Okay. Now the first thing, that you're supposed to do is go to one of the green dots and get yourself a mission. Did I just see a police vehicle? But what I like to always do is find out whether or not the physics work. Out of the way, bit. This is a citizen's arrest. Hold on, let me bring this guy over to the police station. Well, there's definitely crash physics. I like it so far. Just gonna leave this cop with a little present. He's gonna come out and he's gonna be like, I could have sworn I, did that, did that car over there just teleport into the middle of the road? Pardon. I can't wait to get the monster truck. I like that these missions are basically just hieroglyphics. It's like forklift, trailer, van. You know what to do. No, I don't know what to do. I don't know, I guess you click on it. Oh, you're giving Karen a forklift? Game? You just f <laughs> up. So does the... <laughs> Can you lift up other vehicles with this? Hold on, let's find out. I know I have a job to do, but there's no time limit on it, so... Oh, here we go, an ambulance. No one will be needing that. All right, just line up the forks underneath the ambulance here. <laughs> what is this? Are you shitting me game? Give this ambulance a new paint job. I'm just patting this ambulance on the head. You've done well, my child. Okay, the ambulance doesn't work, but the regular cars do. <laughs> Come on, all the way up. Ah, the tires are already breaking, good. Oh, what the, what the fuck? What happened to the vehicle? <laughs> That was an NPC who realized who was playing the game. He's like, that's great, still plays his Steam account, I'm out of here. I just realized something too. We're supposed to be a professional, okay? Do you see what we're wearing on our feet? <laughs> All right, I can't get a monster truck without making money, so. Is this stuff fragile? All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put this in there UPS style. Just gotta aim up. And boom, perfect. Not really gonna ask what sort of paranormal activity caused that one crate to move over to the opposite side of the trailer. Um, 10 out of 10. Okay, now I have to very carefully bring the product over to the end area. 
I like that it does slide around. Oh, sh missed my turn. Damn it. Oh, shit. Oh, mother of Christ. It's a home run. What the fuck? I'm not gonna lie. This game is everything I thought it would be. Oh, the packages get deformed as you screw them up? I've got an idea. It involves going head to head, baby. <laughs> Auto repair. I'm gonna be going there a lot. All right, hold on. Let me see if I can get my trailer to intercept one of these vehicles on the downslope here, Ray. Damn it. Oh, catch an air. Crap. I think it's very important to get drunk before playing this game. What the hell? Hold on, did you guys just see that? That vehicle over there like went over a curb. Apparently I'm not the only person who can't drive worth a damn. We don't need red lights where we're going. Hold on, hold on. Is this, is this like a crime scene? <laughs> can you mess with it? Please tell me you can. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> Poor guy over here has already has like a spinal injury from this traffic crash. It's been hit by you can hit the car. Hey cops, people gotta get to work, all right? Here, let me open up the road for you. Okay. And after all that, we have finally made it to our destination. You know, Karen is like, make this stop. Park vehicle into parking space. Like anyone I want. All right, pull into the space and we're ready to go. Oh, the trailer's supposed to go in here. So normally I imagine you'd have to back this in. Let me just see if I can detach this on the go and throw it in there. There's the right way and the gray way. <laughs> Got it. All I had to do was just hit it into the space with the vehicle. Only 40% damage? Those are rookie numbers. Oh, f me. I just busted my ass for the client and we made like two grand. You know what it sounds like? It sounds like it's time for me to go into the freaking files. We both know that there's a monster truck in the game and y'all want to see monster trucks. I love that there's a config file and there's one single item in it. Developer zero. You know what I'm bad at? Playing game. Do you know what I'm good at? Binary. Purchase all vehicles? Yes, please. Oh, we're going out in a monster truck. And by going out, I mean we're about to put every single insurance agency's entire family through college. Yeah, sure, I'll splurge for the better headlights. Does it come in pink? I gotta put tint on here. Not just so that I don't get skin cancer, but also so that the police can't identify who's driving. Oh, it absolutely does come in pink. Okay, now that is the mom that you want picking you up from school. <laughs> Karen doesn't give a damn so much, she's triple parked. Listen to that baby purr. All right, there's the ex-husband over there. <laughs> it's not so much driving over the car, it's penetrating it. Hold on, let me try and get in some head-ons real quick. I don't have time for your little, whatever the hell that thing is. Holy Jesus Christ. Now we're talking. Well, this is interesting. The other vehicles are powered by Skynet. Heads up, I got stuff to do. <laughs> Sorry, officer. You've been relieved of duty. Don't worry everyone, I'm cleaning, I'm cleaning up the roadway here for you guys. There we go. The road's open. You're welcome. So what types of jobs does a monster truck get? This entire city is gonna go to hell in a handbasket because of me. It is, what the hell? Oh, hey, I went through a fence and ended up in the area that I need to take my next job at. So let me get this straight. Um, I can load cargo into the monster truck and you want me to get it from point A to point B. <laughs> okay. I love how we've picked the highest possible vehicle you can have for fragile material. All right, Karen. Prepare your anus. It's time to make that pig check. All right, the goal this time is to see just how far I can get the different materials in the back to fly. Pretty far. Almost got that one to the next zip code. I gotta tell you something. Whoever paid for this service, their money is in good hands. Today on Discovery, the life of a FedEx driver. I just had the package get thrust up my ass and now one of them is in the undercarriage. You know what? Yeah, sure. Why not? Don't mind me, everyone. Just playing the game exactly how it was meant to be played. Excuse me. Oh, shh. Really? I never thought that this trip would be so perilous. Oh, what the? I like that I've learned how to use my trailer as a slingshot. Ah, oh, crap, I think I was supposed to go down there. It's fine, we can still get there. What happens when you miss your turn? Catch a little air. No! 
Oh, I guess I was supposed to go down here anyway. Not into the water! Oh, piss! So, um... I managed to, uh, get the trailer merged inside of the concrete medium. Yeah. Uh, it's not good. It's okay, I, I can fix this. Just gotta give it a little love tap. Ow, hell. Never mind. It is thoroughly stuck. <laughs> oh, hold on, I got it. I'm just, I'm, I'm cradling it softly. This is kind of embarrassing, but there was something I didn't consider when I chose the monster truck. Um, that's that it gets like half a mile to the gallon. You're gonna give Karen a crate handler? Oh, game. <laughs> I need to know if I can pick up a car with this. All right, now before we do that, the very first thing that you have to do, see, is grab the crate. All right, now that we have the container, go ahead and lift it up as as far as I can. <laughs> All right, everyone, watch out. I've got really poor visibility and a blood alcohol level of like 0.2. All right, just use the roundabout appropriately here. Okay, well, <laughs> here we go. Oh my God. <laughs> Jesus. Actually, let me lower this a little bit so it can act more like a battering ram. Oh, my my bad. I love how there's absolutely no limits in this game. If you want, you could. You don't have to follow the rules at all. <laughs> Is that a sheep? Do the sheep have physics in this game? Guys, can you please get the hell out of the way? I'm trying. To, I'm trying to do something very important. I need to check these sheep out. All right, commence sheep testing in uh, three, two, one. <laughs> Static assets. <gasps> you know it's a top tier game when they haven't removed the artifact from the crops. All right, everyone, you're coming with me. Don't mind me, folks. Nothing to see here. I'm kind of like an Uber. Um, only I can drive three vehicles at once. All right, hold on. I, I gotta test something for science. No fence can stop me. Okay, came. <laughs> hold on. M make me proud. Well, I just need to extend this. Can I? Can I get it? It's, it's, oh, oh, hell yes. All right, now bring it in. <laughs> Come on. God damn it. I'm just gonna go ahead and, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and leave this up to someone else. Probably better off in their hands anyway. Hold on. Just gonna go ahead and put this right there. <laughs> well, we did it. With Karen, we caused about $6 billion in property damage. Now it's time to go to prison. <laughs> anyway, folks. Hope you enjoyed this episode of Truck and Logistics Simulator. Till the next time, stay foxy. <laughs> God, I much love.